Hi everyone, I'm working on a series for the main channel looking at US Army logistics units in large scale conflict. This will be more of a rapid fire primer on what their major logistics units are. I'll cover it again in more depth, but this is more of a compact watch. Starting at the bottom in a maneuver unit meaning infantry and armor, the lowest level sustainment unit is the Ford Support Company or FSC supporting the battalion. The FSC is the first multifunctional sustainment unit. Multifunctional in this sense means a unit with different types of logistics units in it, rather than a specialized single function unit, like a petroleum support company focused solely on fuel or truck company just focused on transport. Ford support companies are technically attached from the Brigade Support Battalion or BSB, but they directly support a specific battalion. As of right now, the FSC has a company headquarters, field feeding section, distribution platoon, and maintenance platoon. Normally, a field maintenance team from the maintenance platoon will be attached to combat companies, including things like a contact truck for maintenance support and recovery vehicles. Depending on the situation, most of the transportation assets in the distribution platoon could also be centralized to the brigade level so the BSB support operations officer can synchronize movement schedules during brigade operations. The FSC commander is their supported battalion's senior logistician. The next level up is the brigade support battalion, from which the FSCs are attached and replenished. BSBs are organic to brigade combat teams in most cases with the notable exception being the 82nd Airborne, as they've recently transferred them to the Division Sustainment Brigade. In addition to the FSCs, BSBs include a Headquarters and Headquarters Company, Distribution Company, Field and Maintenance Company, and Medical Company. The BSB Commander is the Brigade's Senior Logistician. The level above that is the Division Sustainment Brigade, or DSB, which directly supports their assigned division. These consist of a Special Troops Battalion and a Division Sustainment Support Battalion or DSSB. It can also control five battalions attached from higher up. The Special Troops Battalion controls attached companies, particularly in the realm of human resources, finance, field feeding or food service, and mortuary affairs. The DSSB, meanwhile, is a logistics battalion that, after division centric reforms, has some organic companies and can also control attached companies. DSSBs are replacing Combat Sustainment Support Battalions or CSSBs at the division level. The former will be directly aligned to the needs of their division, while the latter are more modular, tailorable to specific operations, and held at higher levels or attached to divisions. This is a change, as before about the mid-2010s, sustainment brigades would support divisions but were not under their command, and did not necessarily have the right company mix optimized for supporting a division as opposed to a core. DSSBs doctrinally include an HQ and HQ company, composite supply company, composite truck company of the heavy HET, PLS, and MTV variety for heavy divisions, or the light PLS and MTV variety for light divisions, and a division support maintenance company. It can also control up to four additional attached companies. Although not a logistics unit itself, the Maneuver Enhancement Brigade also bears mentioning. They provide control and protection for the division's rear area, and do things like secure routes, defeat limited enemy threats in the rear, and organize rear area basing. A division basically requires a Maneuver Enhancement Brigade to be attached for this function. With the Army 2030 reforms, these may be renamed to Protection Brigades and either made organic or permanently aligned to the supported division. Above Division, the Commanding Sustainment Headquarters is the Expeditionary Sustainment Command or ESC. ESCs can have a number of different roles. For example, they can be forward extensions of theater sustainment commands, which are aligned to whole continent-spanning combatant commands and basically coordinate logistics for a theater army. ESCs can take a more detailed control of logistics if a theater is geographically fragmented, like the wars in Iraq and Afghanistan which were both under CENTCOM but obviously completely different wars. They can also act as the logistics coordinating authority if a field army is stood up and each corps has an expeditionary sustainment command to coordinate their logistics. 
ESCs mainly control attached sustainment brigades while coordinating with division sustainment brigades. Sustainment brigades can control up to six functional battalions or multifunctional combat sustainment support battalions, which can each control up to six attached sustainment companies. Examples of functional battalions that would be supporting a core or army are petroleum support, movement control, and finance battalions, which are focused on a specialized role. If you'd like to learn how this stuff works in practice, check out my video on US Army Fuel Logistics. I'll see you over there.